I'm at a road cut south of Lake Michigami here. I've been trying to find the Storolite schists for a long time, and I finally found a few. I don't want to take a huge piece like this for two reasons. Number one, it's huge. Number two, you can't see the Storolites very well. The dark lumps in here are the Storolites. The rest of this is the schist. They form beautiful twin crystals. But it's very hard to get out of the rock unless nature kind of does it for you. So I'm going to dig around and I'm going to see if I can't find some nicer pieces of the schist. And maybe some standalone crystals. They will sometimes weather out and be left behind in the soil right next to the rocks. So we'll see if we can find anything here today. All right, along the same road cut here, I did find a smaller piece of the Storolite schist. This guy right here. But these are real baby Storolites. You can see them trying to poke out of the rock. But in fact, you can see one very nice twin Storolite crystal there. See that cross shape there? Not where my thumb is, but it should be centered the screen there. They form it's called twinning. These are called cruciform because they are kind of cross-shaped. And uh, sometimes your uh, ultra-religious folk will refer to these as crucifix crystals or something similar. Describe it as some religious property. But in fact, it's a very natural phenomenon. So it's very cool because it's not very common in nature, really. But you get that in store lights. I'm going to try to find some nice ones out here. I found some actual, actual storolite schist formation rock here. I've scraped away the moss to expose it. All these lumps you see in here, especially these cruciform ones, those are your storolite, storolite crystals in there. Unfortunately, it's really hard to get them out. You can't, you really can't chisel them out. They're really really in there so what you gotta do is you gotta find a crack somewhere where they might have weathered out naturally over the years so I'm gonna start sticking my fingers around in here seeing what I can pull out if anything if I get anything I'll let you know if not I may come home with a chunk of sterilized schist certainly nothing this large this will geez it's probably like half a ton well here I am at the cabinet of wonders and I wanted to show you what I was looking for in terms of store lights uh, in the Michigami area. And these were collected from the Michigami area many, many years ago. That's what I was hoping to find weathered out. Let's see if I can find good lighting here. These are the store light crystals that show the twinning, particularly the cruciform twinning, cruciform being cross shaped twins. See that? There's, a, there's two crystals, a little bit broken up, but not badly. You got a nice twin right there. Let me set that aside here. See what other nice ones we have like that. There's the angle I want. Have a look at that. Isn't that nice? Two crystals growing right through each other. Beautiful. So what I found out there on this trip was a lot of uh, Storolite Garnet schist. But I couldn't find a good patch of weathered out material that contained a lot of these Storolites already taken out for me. So I came back relatively empty handed. This gives me something to look for next time. Aren't these guys awesome? I love them.